everyone, and welcome to Governments Are Rabbit About Spending Other People's Money, or Grasp Them. Today's winner is the European Union and G7 nations, who seek to spend $323 billion of frozen Russian central bank assets to finance Ukraine. In their first move towards that goal, yesterday the EU passed law where profits from confiscated Russian assets could be sent to Ukraine via the EU budget. One such asset, the central securities depositories like Belgium's Euroclear, whose holdings of Russian assets make up $4 billion a year. Ukrainian Foreign Minister Dmitry Kuleba asked for Kiev's backers to go further and to, quote, work with partners on reaching our ultimate goal, making Russian assets available to Ukraine. EU also sent $53.89 billion in aid to Kiev separately. In second place is the United States of America, whose Senate just today passed a bill to send $95.3 billion in aid to Ukraine, Israel, and Taiwan. The vote passed 70 to 29, with nearly all Democrat senators saying yes and 22 Republican senators saying yes. Also, according to a Huffington Post article, the State Department is assessing whether Israel violated international law during their actions in Gaza. This contradicts statements made by White House spokesperson John Kirby and Biden's own administration.